If you're into display technology, you'll know that there is loads to pick from, from LCD to QLED to mini LED. This tech is actually evolving really quickly and that there is somebody in this space who is at the forefront of that evolution, especially when it comes to OLED and that is TCL CSOT. So at MWC 2025, we've been checking out loads of different innovations, but when it comes to display tech, it was only right that we came to check out TCL at their booth because they are industry leading. Now, of course, smartphones and tablets are just central to everything that we do, but what if they were easier on the eyes, they were more power efficient and could deliver smoother, sharper visuals than ever before? Well, that's exactly what TCL CSOT is bringing to MWC with a lineup of next-gen displays designed to transform the way we experience screens. And that starts with eye protection. If you're like me, you just spend hours on your tablet, but TCL has a solution that's inspired by nature. Now, that 12.1-inch Moth-Eye Biomimetic Display is engineered for ultimate eye protection using a combination of low blue light, flicker-free technology and an anti-glare structure model after moth's eyes to minimize reflections. But it's not just about comfort because efficiency matters as well. And that's why TCL CSOT developed something industry leading. Now this is a lowest driver, low power screen at 6.36 inches. Now the display is really interesting because the way to stop that battery drain is by having this display divided into three sections that support three different refresh rates. And because of that split, it reduces the power consumption by up to 31% over its last generation. And because it features a breakthrough in partitioned frequency technology, this means that at 500 nits, it will need almost 20% less power than a regular display, while at the same time, not needing to drop that high refresh rate, you get full performance and stunning color depth, which I think is perfect for smartphones and wearables that need to be lasting all day. Their world first 4K 144Hz AI powered tablet display is a real game changer. With an impressive 346 ppi, the screen is built for AI computing, creative design and immersive entertainment. And thanks to its intelligent partition frequency LCD refresh rate technology, it automatically adjusts performance to balance power efficiency and smooth motion. Some of the most exciting developments in OLED tech are transforming professional displays as well, and that certainly is the case here here as TCL CSOT as they've spent years on research and development to bring the first mass produced 21.6 inch professional inkjet printing 4K OLED display to the market. Now this is built for creators and professionals who demand perfection and the huge display has over 99% DCI-P3 color coverage, 10 bit grayscale precision and ultra fast response times as well. And because it's designed with reduced blue light exposure it's also much better for making long creative sessions even more comfortable. I also got the opportunity to speak to Zhao Mingzhong, who is Chief of Technology Planning Center at TCL CSOT, who told me a little bit more about how this works. Uh, inject printing compared to com conventional OLED, you have a different uh, scenario. And we have a lot of design uh, because we have a LTPS background and the uh, spatial architecture, so we can achieve a more power efficiency than conventional OLED. So it also can uh, achieve very good color gamma. So we think this is a very uh, cutting edge performance in the uh, OLED compared to the original OLED. But the inject printing have a regular uh, stripe RGB arrangement. So you can uh, show the image more vivid and more clear. Besides, uh, because the material is by printing, so compared to conventional one, the utilization may be just 30%, but they can up to 90%. So it's very good for sensibility and uh, cost efficiency. Now, the next-gen inkjet printing OLED tech is also powering this 14-inch QDEL display for notebooks. This one has 240 ppi resolution, covers 85% of the BT2020 gamut for enhanced accuracy and cutting-edge top emission QDEL structure, which helps deliver stunning brightness, rich colors, and unbelievable detail. And because this supports variable refresh rates from 30 to 100 20 hertz every time you use this display it just feels really smooth and it just cuts back on power because of that variable refresh rate and it's this kind of next-gen OLED tech that is just setting new standards as well as these displays Xiao Ming Zhang wanted to show us something that they were really proud of I will show you something really uh, interesting uh, because our conventional our notebook still have a camera hole uh, we have a uh, camera under the screen for example here is a uh, here is a camera indicator here. So it can uh, bring the end customer's real 
uh, full screen to end customers and a very good experience. And we have also the same uh, PPI, so you cannot detect any difference between the camera and the outer active area. Now TCL at the booth aren't just focusing on physical displays, there's actually quite a bit going on as well with their virtual reality displays and there's a headset just behind me here so let me tell you a little bit about that one. This is the world's first mass-produced 1512 PPI VR headset and it features dual 4K 3.59 inch displays at 3840 by 3744 so one for each eye which combines together to create a VR image that goes up to 8K resolution. Now it is hard to show you exactly what I'm seeing here, but this might be the clearest image that we've ever seen from a VR headset. And both displays reach about 200 nits, which is double compared to some of the competing devices. And while a lot of VR headsets suffer from distortion or loss of detail on the edges, the 120 degree field of view ensures that even at wide viewing angles, everything is crisp and immersive. It's incredibly colorful too, as the 96% DCI P3 color gamut is producing room really vibrant and realistic visuals. TCL isn't stopping there either as it also has this 2.56 inch LCD VR display with an ultra high 1512 PPI for crystal clear images. But it's not just about sharp visuals, it's also engineered for better power efficiency and environmental sustainability. Using LTPO backplane driver technology and high luminous efficiency mini LED backlighting, this display boosts brightness up to 40% compared to traditional mini LEDs, which means it eliminates screen defects, it improves energy efficiency, and it makes every frame just feel a little bit more lifelike. But I really wanted to ask Zhao Ming Zhong after using this VR headset, just how difficult it is to create these type of displays. Uh, actually, uh, for the virtual reality, uh, because it is very close to our eye, so we have to achieve very high resolution, high density. For example, for these uh, virtual reality devices, the PPI will up to uh, 1,500 PPI. We can achieve a very high PPI, also have the uh, uh, highest brightness, uh, high efficiency about the uh, refresh rate. They can provide a uh, real smooth the reality uh, experience to our users. Today is already mass budget. Our next space will be 1,700. They were also very challenging and a very good experience for end users. Getting to look at the future of displays at the TCL CSOT booth was really exciting and the fact that they are producing these displays in more eco-friendly ways with lower emissions and with power consumption that can be up to 20% less than traditional OLED is really impressive. Xiaoming Zhang also wanted to introduce their new Apex brand which is there for its leading products. I am very proud to uh, announce our technology brand uh, Apex. That means uh, the full direction. The A means the amazing experience about the uh, feature quality, and the P means the uh, protective because we want to provide a reliable uh, visual health to our end customers. We want to uh, push extend the boundary about the display. We hope everywhere have a display, and every kind of display will be our target. So this is our uh, iPad means. Uh, very good image quality, very good for your eye, and uh, very eco, uh, environmental friendly. That's our iPad. Now, not everything that you've seen at the booth is available to buy right now, but it does give us a really good look at the future of displays, and TCL CSOT are at the forefront of that.